If you recognize any of the men from the surveillance video, we want you to take another look uh, at this situation that happened in Milford. Milford police want to know uh, if you have any details. They want to know more about the investigation. Perhaps you can help them. They're really trying to track down what happened there. Brad, over to you. Thanks, Carrie Lee. After five months of intense debate, negotiation, the 2013 legislative session is now in the record book. So, what did our lawmakers accomplish? Political analyst Patrick Scully is here to break things down for us. Patrick, good to see you again. A lot of landmark bills and, and plenty of political wrangling as always, but moving forward, what do you think are the things that will have the greatest impact on the greatest number of people in Connecticut? Well, there's no question that the pall of the Newtown tragedy was there for the entire session beginning and then culminating yesterday with $50 million for a new Sandy Hook school. The good news is that local aid was maintained, so your property taxes shouldn't have to go up as a result of that. But the state is still teetering on the fiscal brink. They, bought, they uh, approved borrowing $750 million yesterday to pay for previous debt. They were borrowing to pay for the borrowing. So there's a, there's a lot of go stuff going on with the financial situation. Uh, there is more aid for uh, education. That's good news as well. The minimum wage is going up. And then yesterday on the last day, they also uh, did things such as in, uh, increasing the, the fines for texting while driving. So though they, it was a very long session. Uh, lawmakers were there overnight many times. And I, I think it was a mixed bag as far as the success of the session. So from the lawmakers' perspectives, I know there's always debate about how, how much the Democrats dominate there. From a lawmaker's perspective and, and from the, the kind of utility for, for the average person, how would you, can you put a grade on it for us for, for this session? Well, I would say it was a B. Uh, uh, the budget is balanced, but it was done with, let's say, some creative uh, accounting. There are no new taxes technically, but some taxes were extended that were supposed to go away. Your gas tax is going up July 1st, not in this budget, but they didn't do anything to stop it either. So I think depending on the issue, uh, it was a, a mixed bag of good and bad, but there was a lot of activity and one of the busiest sessions I've seen in years. All right, Patrick Scully, our political analyst, thanks so much for your perspective. Harry Lee, over to you. Thank you to both of you. All right, four Connecticut police officers could be off the job in a matter of hours. Audrey. Yes, yeah, the first day of a disciplinary hearing where four Danbury officers will try to save their job.